neighborhood grieving tonight after a baby boy drowns in Buckeye. ABC 15's Kim Tobin joins us live from that community off the I-10 in Yuma. And Kim, we're actually hearing that the child died at the hospital. Stephanie, that's right. We know that the Phoenix Children's Hospital helicopter landed here at the park behind me. That one-year-old boy flown to the hospital, but unfortunately, he passed away shortly after arriving there. We do have a look at the crime scene from last night. That scene tape up, investigators combing through the house, taking photos, investigating, talking to the people inside. Police tell us the baby boy was found unresponsive in a bathtub. At this point, police say they are investigating and they could not tell us if the parents would face any charges. Neighbors tell me that everybody gathered outside last night and they saw a man in the driveway screaming and crying. You know, he was on the driveway and he was just bending over. He was devastated. You could tell there's something terrible happened in that home. A lot of neighbors up all through the evening with all the commotion going on out here. They tell me that uh, this family has only lived here for a short amount of time, maybe a few months, and that they did have other young children inside the house. We did try to knock on that door this afternoon. No answer from the family as they are obviously dealing with this very heartbreaking situation. We'll send it back to you. Yeah.